Today's radical feminist movement does not care about women. Instead of being a voice for our most vulnerable women and girls, they turned a blind eye to abortion, its impacts and its victims. Last year, I was attacked by the pro-abortion lobby simply for being a pro-life woman. In Australia, image-based abuse is a crime and punishable with up to six years in jail. I was subject to a form of sexual abuse by the pro-abortion lobby. And did they care? Of course not. The pro-abortion feminist movement in Australia has no respect for pro-life people, especially women. They will take any steps necessary to silence us. On Australian university campuses, our life tree students have had glitter and condoms thrown at them, personal property smashed or vandalised, and events shut down. We've been stalked. We've received rape threats. I've met far too many women who have had an abortion and regret it. When I ask them why they made the decision to have an abortion, the answer is almost always the same. I didn't have another choice. The radical feminist movement is a lie. If you're a woman who is hurting after abortion, they will ignore you. If you're a person who is conceived in rape, they will say you shouldn't exist. If you're a person with a disability, they will say that you're better off dead. We need to look beyond the shiny buzzwords of empowerment and women's rights that the radical feminist movement has laid claim to and realise that there are only one group of people who truly believe in this, and they are pro-life. We are the ones who are empowering pregnant and parenting students to finish their education. We're out there fighting for women's rights for our unborn sisters. We are the ones who are truly pro-women.